Hey everyone, it's Wilson here back with another video. This is gonna be another first time reaction. We got SB19 What the Official Music Video. So for some background, when I reacted to Marcelino Pomoy, someone came across my channel and said, Hi, can you react to SB19? They're also from the Philippines. They just uploaded their latest MV entitled What? The leader wrote, composed, and co-produced the song. The youngest is the creative director and all of them choreographed the song too. Smiley face. Fun fact. According to a friend of the production, they have limited budget for this MV. The production is all Filipino. The scene on the desert is actually Lahar, a volcanic mud flow, not sand. All of it was shot here in the Philippines. Here it is. Thank you so much for the comment. I really appreciate everyone's support and for giving me recommendations because it's really fun for me and I'm learning more and more every day as a reaction. Actor. So let's get right into it, guys. Wait a second. Oh. Very stylish. No, simula no, pero wala na kung balak na tapusin. Di ibig sabihin pag di tinapos ako, yihinto na rin. Okay. I don't know why. I didn't expect it to be like this. I should be reacting with a blank page because I'm just like, all right, someone came by to watch a Marcelito Pomoy video, recommended something, and then bam, it's like a group. I, I just didn't expect the genre, you know? So, wow. Right to the start. It seems really dark. They're all dressed in black. And there's rap to start things off. Let's go. Let's go. I'm ready. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna run that back, but did you guys see that chair? It looks like it's from Game of Thrones or something. I'm, I'm keeping in mind of everything I read from the comment that said that they all produced this with a limited budget. And wow, they already started going crazy with the effects. You know, being able to perform within a newspaper, having all these transitions. If I'm being honest, this sounds similar to K-pop music. And yeah, K-pop's good. I don't know what to specifically call this, but ju I'm just letting you guys know. I'm saying that this is a good thing, not a bad thing. Starting off with like two uh, rappers with their verses. Let's go. Let's get into this. Uh, let's get into the singing part. What? They give off a lot of energy. That's something I could appreciate. Their outfit changes go crazy though, like... Sheesh. They look like they're in a tomb right now while like the fire pit torches behind them and whatever they're wearing makes them kind of look like mummies. And then again, with the editing that I mentioned before, you just see this guy in a blue robe, his blue contacts in like the starry skies, transitioning from the earth and the plants and all that. That was nuts. And if this is the chorus, because they mentioned what, the beat is very unique. I thought it'd be like a super fast paced song where they would like jam out and do their choreo thing. There's like increments of pauses. <laughs> The tornado kick. Wow, that, that just felt like a part two of the song. It was like, all right, we're moving on. Were you surprised? You're going to be even more surprised. That's the feel I just got from that. It's like, did it just end? Yeah, the transitioning is crazy. If it feels like I'm speaking with so much energy, it's because I'm like trying to process everything, just putting it into words. But I'm entertained. <laughs> Oh, there it is. Oh, 
What? Okay, now it all starting to make sense. They're all like kind of in their separate places too. I think if there's only five people in the group, then yeah, because all the scenes are starting to fit together. It is a catchy tune. I don't know what they're saying, obviously, but it fits to like uh, my musical tastes, like something I would listen to, especially because it has like a high energy, eccentric vibe to it. And again, I'm someone who is very keen with editing. Not that I edit well, but it was just super cool when he was like this, he was like, and then the camera angle actually like just freaking changed from 90 degrees and rotated back though those little tiny things that i noticed just makes it all better and everything looks clean so far the choreo what Yeah, that, that was sick. It was the chorus part again. I also noticed uh, the, the scratching part for sure. It's almost like when you're on the record scratching on the DJ and then they brought out the flags that represents their logo. This is a really fun song and I could see why it would be recommended because I'm starting to see a lot of more pop style recommendations. I don't mind whatsoever. I'm down to react to whatever. So this is sick. some dancing with no music. Okay, I like it. They had like a whole scene in their music video dedicated to their choreography. Gee, that was clean. Like, I just love that bass feel to it because every time they make movements, it just goes hard with it. It's not even subtle at all. And this shape in the end, like their formation, like what do you what do you call that formation? It, I don't know. I feel like it could be interpreted in a lot of things or maybe I'm just kind of going in over my head. There you go. That's clever. That is really clever. Like they're not seeing their own chorus right now. It's more of like an echo in the background as if it feels like the people dressed in white are kind of like carrying on the sound. I feel like a lot of time and dedication was put into this music video. They split the parts up so well and it's like every scene is different. They don't like try to go back to like what we saw in the first like two minutes of the video. It's just interchangeable, different outfits, costumes, dancing styles. And I'm slowly able to like distinguish their voices especially the guy with the right here with the blonde highlight yeah his his voice is standing out to me
I'm going deep in this, you know? I'm really trying to think about everything. I like how they dedicate some of the choreo to like fit with the description of who they're trying to be. So like when they were dancing in the army costumes, at one point they did like a move where they did a salute type of thing. I thought that was really clean. And then when they were looking like those mummies in the tomb, you could see them kind of like flailing their arms around. It's almost like the mummy wraps like dangling around. I thought that was sick too. It's like really effective to portray their characters. It's a very lively performance. Imagine seeing this live. <laughs> <laughs> they ended with that. All right, and that was it for this video. Thank you guys so much for sticking by. I hope you enjoyed that. That was very enjoyable. That was a really clean ending. Si a simple what to dedicate to the title of the song. This was literally the first time I've ever heard of this group. Just like K-pop, I don't understand Korean, so... But most of the songs I've heard are amazing. Same goes for this one. Props to the SB19 group. The last words to say is that they're... They seem to be natural entertainers. They work with what they had in terms of the budget, and they they just killed this performance. It's a wrap. Take care. Have a wonderful day. Peace.